Okay, in this video we'll look at pod mass, uh, which is bracket order. Um, order means power or order. Then division, multiplication. Then addition, subtraction. Is it just a convention or is there any logic to it? So one of the logics is that we often have a sum of products. So if I, if I went and I bought three items for five rupees each and these things were rupees five each and if I bought four items For rupees six each, then I would write it as okay. This is three times five. This is four times six. How much did I spend as a whole? Is three times five plus four times six. Now, in order to make sure that if you, of course, if you enter this in a calculator, as you enter the operations, it will add fifteen plus four and then multiply by six. That's not what I mean to do. So we could have had uh, used brackets to make sure this is done first, this is done first. And in all the cases, if you use sufficient brackets, you can always say what needs to be done first and what needs to be done next. But that's a lot of brackets. It could be a lot of brackets. And in some cases, it's not needed. For example, if I did 11 plus 4 plus 6, then no matter what order in which I did it, whether I did this or I did this, the result would be the same. I mean, it may be more convenient, it may be easier because we see pattern and say 4 plus 6 is a 10 and then if I add 11, then I get 21. It may be easier, but it is not necessary to do that to get the same result. You will get the same result. Now, this is not the case for something like subtraction. Again, in multiplication, if you had 5 times 6 times 3, then potentially doing 5 times 6 times 3 is the same as 5 times 6 times 3. It may be more convenient to do the first because you get a 30 and then you can multiply by 3 and get a 90 rather than multiplying this and saying it's 18 and 5. So it may be more convenient but it is not a different result. But if you had something like now this one depending on what you did if you did this you would get 1 minus 1 which is 0 but if you did this you get 3 minus 1 which is a 2 they are not the same so brackets can always be used and that's why they are given the most importance to clarify what an expression is supposed to mean in a convention right but if you don't want to use so many brackets what is a more logical uh, sequence and is there any any logic to the board mass? So there is because often we encounter a sum of products and in order for a sum of products to make sense it is it is that you do the products first and then add the sums. Yeah, So that's one thing. So we've sort of talked about why let's say <clears throat> the set of operations on division multiplication class comes before addition subtraction class in terms of a sum of products okay? that sort of form that it makes it convenient for everyone to understand that you know we are talking about multiplication first and doing addition and many of this actually leads up to well algebra so if i have an expression Yeah. and I want to write it without putting too many brackets now we all if you write this it is assumed that 
by now we are looking at it as well it is an x square it's not i'm multiplying 2 with x and doing a square right otherwise i would need to write it as uh, sorry in fact x square in brackets first to the square then multiply by 2 and so on right so in order for us to be able to write an expression neatly and cleanly we are already assuming that I understand that this is a square of x and then I am multiplying by 2. So the order is being given a preference. Yeah. So otherwise it would be very hard to write expressions. If you, if you wrote pi r square as the area of a circle and you had confusion whether pi has to be multiplied by r first or squared first this expression would be quite hard to write. You would need to start writing as r square pi and even then there are cases when this would not really quite work out. So uh, as what we are doing uh, in the calculations and expressions that are being written move up to things like algebra then the fact that powers have a distinction have this uh, uh, have a priority uh, over the multiplication and division makes sense. So you will have orders bracket is of course you can change you can if you put a bracket here it means something entirely different. Right? So uh, the brackets always have the highest priority. So we'll leave that out. Then the next is order. Then you have the division multiplication and addition subtraction. So this is the some of the logic behind why there is these, where are these conventions.